What's up guys? Welcome to another video of Telegram bot using Python. In my last videos, which you can find them on top right of this video, I went through how to create a bot using Botfather in Telegram. Then I connected to API so I could talk with that bot using Python. I'm not gonna go through those codes, those, those video discussion and processes, so you can watch those videos to get the idea and know how to write the code. In today's video, I'm gonna go through a process of questioning and answering with user. For example, you wanna get lots of information like name, age, height, whatever from your user and store them in database. I'm not going to talk about database today, maybe in other videos, but I'm going to show you how you can do this process of question and answer with user. To do that, I'm going to use next step handlers in Python. Let's see how can I implement that process. So first I'm going to use bot.messageHandler and commands. start okay if i get this i go through this function start message welcome whatever you like i get the message from the user so i write but send message to message.chat id and i write please enter your name okay then i type bot register next step handler using this next step handler i can continue with another question from the user so i type process name this is the name of the function that i'm gonna go through after this def process name inside here i get the message from the user so i get the name from message.text so i know the name of the user which i have asked here so i'm gonna type bot.send message to message.chat ID and using an F string like this. Hello, inside curly bracket, name, exclamation mark. And after that, backslash N, how old are you? So I need another next step handler to get the age from the user. So I type, but register register next step handler for my message and here process age so i'm gonna type def process age message from the user and here i'm gonna get the age from message dot text so i type bot send message yo to message.chat id and using an f string like this you are inside curly bracket age years old backslash n Thank you. Okay, so through this Q&A, I get the name and age of my user. You can go through this process and get lots of information through this Q&A process from the user, okay? Let's run the bot. Okay, everything good. Menu, I need to send start. You can Use this button or simply type slash start, whatever you like, both of them work properly. Okay, please enter your name. My name is Asan 
And hello, Hassan. How old are you? I'm 34. That's it. You are 34 years old. Thank you. So you can store this uh, name age in global variables. So after getting whatever information you like from the user, you can connect to your database, whatever it is, SQLite tree, Postgres, SQL, whatever, and save those information in proper table in your database. This is called next step handler. So you can get lots of information from the user with, with a Q and a process. I hope you like this video. So please give this video a thumbs up and comment out your ideas below this video. I believe that your comments gonna help me to make more better videos.